So in this video, I'm going to be playing the Lego Star Wars up to the original trilogy on my PSP, or for those who know, PlayStation Portable. Alright, so now I'm going to show, because I was playing some levels, I was like, no, you should do it for video. And of course, I cheated and used some cheat codes, but that's because I can't remember achievements, so I was like, yeah, whatever. And you get different bonuses here. Your characters you unlock here. on PSP. This is crazy sounds. This is actually my very first time playing on PSP. I've never played. I played every ever system and game on except for PSP. So I was like, well, this will be interesting. This is not that hard. I try and I believe it. I'm going to do most easy spaceport. So far, it shouldn't show because it's not lightning. The lightning stopped, so thank God. Like I said, I'm gonna try my best to make sure it doesn't ruin the video. And so, if I have to, I'll end the video early if I have to, but I prefer not to. But it's kind of weird. Usually, it lets me skip this credits, which is kind of boring. But for some reason, it won't. And of course now for some reason it's taking forever to load. There you go. Finally loaded. I don't know why it took that long. It doesn't normally take that long. But you know too, my PSP I got I got originally in 2005 when it was first released. So now. And since my original unfortunately, you know, my old husky dog I used to have and chewed on it, so some buttons don't work, so I had to get a new one. So that may be why it's slow. Due to this cosmetic damage. And unfortunately, the husky dog my grandparents had. Ugh, it was a pain. That dog was a pain. I don't like to chew on things too much. And of course, you saw my PSP, grabbed it, and started chewing on it. Okay, I mean, look, okay, for the most part, it works, but of course, it occasionally screws up where it loads slower. So I'm going to have to look into investing into a newer PSP. Which I saw some. I saw this limited edition Star Wars one. I was like, oh, I so why they want a Star Wars PSP. Oh, let me play this a little bit. There we go. And I usually just play it and choose different characters. Little story mode. And stuff. Alright, so. Just have to pause it real quick to do something real quick. Alright, but here we go. So yeah, so if you guys enjoyed this, I can, I can see doing more videos like this, you know. But if I you know, get the PSP games to try, since I do regular games, oh, oops, regular games, but watch like, you know, PSP games to see how they do. It's a little bit of a pain because the screen's so tiny, so it's kind of hard to see exactly what I'm doing. But, you know, but I try the best I can to keep it still. But I do have ADHD, so it's, sometimes it's a little hard to stay still. Stormtroopers was trying to start stuff, so I'll take them, take care of those guys. But the good thing is you can get the red brick on this level in story mode, and you don't have to, you don't have to do the other mode where you do your own character. Um, I prefer the complete saga because it's more fun, but this is still good. I am 
using my new newer phone and phone the other phone I use for recording, which is, which is basically turned on Android. So it's just a backup phone that nobody uses anymore. And it's like, you know, so and but you know, it's still good though, it doesn't have a cracked screen or anything. You know, so it has and plus you guys would love to like this recorded with this particular um, camera, which is on the, obviously the, which is basically the other camera on the phone. So I was like, well, why don't you do it on this video? I mean, this camera, phone, yeah, wrong thing. <laughs> and so I thought, well, I want, I think this video would do good, especially since I know some people really like my Star Wars content. So I was like, well, I'm trying this video. Let's keep and see how it does. Keep seeing video. I don't know why. Okay. That's the only part of the pain. It's dealing with these stormtroopers. They have to use the force. And of course, if you get shot by the blasters, then it, it stops and you have to do it all over again, which is a major pain that you know what. <laughs> if you get you know what I mean. Let's do the best I can. Stats. And this is how you get the red brick in story mode. Uh, R2 D2. So just gotta go to R2 D2, grab him, there we go. And of course, Ben Kobe took off. Bring your red brick. I can't remember what the bonus says, but I know they give you I know they give you some sort of bonus. I just can't remember what it was exactly. Dude, seriously, quit taking a lot of the players, yeah. You know, r 2 just a good character and all, but I remember I play as a Jedi. So this thing is a little bit easier. We were supposed to use a oh, of course, why not? So, uh, the bonus is, of course, since I haven't played Progress far, I can't have Invincibility, which will make it a heck of a lot easier. <laughs> of course, I don't have that cheat. I mean, I will not cheat, but I don't have that power up in your shit. Once I beat episode 4 and I go to the right level, which I think is the Death Star, I believe it's Death, I believe Death Star Escape, I think is where you, you get that bonus to have invisibility. I'm not sure, but I think that is, I have to see. So, I really want to get for the level so I can do that, that way I can actually, you know, cheat it. And of course, the current phone I'm using, the like record. <laughs> that's the part of the pain for this game. There's these stormtroopers that they just gang up on you and make it a lot of pain in, pain in the rear end to, to defeat these guys and win. Oh, that's good. Yeah, get that canister. That'll help. Cheers. Cheers, mate. That sounds good. And I should know because my ancestors were British, but which I can't remember. So I'm starting to solve this, and it has a bit of space on this particular phone, so I won't be able to record from you for a very long time, but I can record for at least for a little bit. And I, and I can only let me do like 15 minutes and 33 seconds maximum. So I have, I'll get as close to that as possible. So probably a 15 minute video, maybe, or close to it. I need to make sure that there's at least some space uh, even after the video. Because I'll try the best I can. Especially when I get to the fun part. I think C, oh actually, yeah, that might have worked. I forgot. Oh, come on, you gotta be kidding me. I don't really like that invincibility, it's such a pain. Especially, especially, well, especially the stormtroopers, they like to harass you and drive you crazy. Yeah, they just, you know, they just stalk you like it's like, dude, 
Give him a chance like escape. Holy crap. Because I need that to be there. Let's see, 3 p.m. needs to unlock the door so we can get the heck away from these these looting tunes. takes long to load, <laughs> unfortunately. Do a little donuts just to be, just to be goofy. Oh, come on, every time it happens. Wish that sucks, because that's a lot of took a lot of uh, Lego studs I'm losing. Uh, this is the part we got. Ten gazillion stormtroopers are gonna drive you crazy. No, oh, I can't see see three people so fuck that. Yeah, I got yeah, do that. That way, yeah, that way at least he responds and gets his legs back. And his arm. This is part of what we call the ATST. Let's try again for this one. I want to try and build it if I can, if I don't run out of time with that video. And if I do, I do, but I would prefer to get it done. That way I can show you guys what it looks like. It's definitely one of the funner parts of the uh, level. Having a Lego ATST to drive around in. You can shoot the Star Troopers and take them out. With the ATST, it's so much fun. Take the head you put up top there, which I won't do just yet because I want to collect some Lego studs. The stormtrooper is going to keep coming out every five seconds to steal the ATST. So, so in a way, I can make sure I get my Lego studs after that last. But you know, I'm just going to show you the most part of what it looks like. I got a lot to cover. There's a lot to cover when it comes to getting Lego studs. I want to get the true generator. close to where I can't record much longer or else the video, the camera will stop recording altogether so I'll have to wrap this up like pretty soon or I should say extremely soon we got a canister that too is good and like I said, you can take that and you put it up top there and then boom, you have AT, like an ATST mini model I think it's the mini mall version, I think. I don't know, I could be wrong. I used to have this set too. That was in a game. It's, it's been so long that I can't remember. It's so many years. Now I have the modern day of ATST, like a mini model. But, mm, of course I lost it. When I was a kid, I probably lost it or I got mixed up with a couple of other sets. There's a 
way to grab here somehow. There's a, there's a, yeah, that's the trick here. Alright, that's the end of this video because it's about to cut off. The video is about to cut off if I don't finish it. So I don't want, I don't want to cut off and ruin anything. So let me try this video. Let me try this video. Remember to like, comment, subscribe, and let me share my videos. So let's see my videos. And if you like this video, be sure to let me know in the comments below. And I'll do, an, I'll do another video just like this. A little bit longer. So until then, I will see you.